Mother's Day, you guys. As usual, I'm having a great hair day. Oh man, <laughs> didn't look at the mirror before I did this. Anyway, um, so my second Thursday video. Today I've decided, a lot of people ask me what I do before a run and I honestly think it's just out of curiosity because all of us barrel racers have like weird things that we do in a weird routine. So I'm gonna show you what I do with Grinchy. It's a little bit different than what I do with Chase, um, but she's kind of got very specific things just because I've owned her so long I know what works and you know, I just kind of go with what I know works for her. So I'm gonna show you what I do on um, the day I'm gonna take her somewhere to a barrel race All right, so the day I'm competing and also the day before I will feed these little pills to any mare Don't ask me to say it. I want to say Yao how one. I don't know Chinese medicine. Anyway, they are really awesome for a mare um, Especially when they compete. I don't know. I just find it kind of keeps them a little bit more focused And they're just like these little like tea pills they call them I think and uh, yeah I just chuck about 10 of them on top of her green. All right Green Chi and I are heading to the race today wearing all of her back on track and I'm going to show you what I do before I put her in the trailer. Okay so I use a little bit of a Meprazole for my vet it's the one with L-glutamine so it makes it a little more expensive um, but I believe that means that it also covers hind gut ulcers as well so I give her 15 cc's of this before I put her in the trailer. And then, of course, my botanicals. Pot um, I give her 20 cc's. You can also just put it on grain because they like the taste of it, but I just make sure that she actually gets it in her mouth. All right, so 15 cc's of glutamine, or pardon me, glutamine and omeprazole. And then 20 cc's of botanicals. I just give this on days that I race. Um, it's got some CBD in there to help with pain and stress, um, and it's a hemp oil, so good stuff. Also, if you guys want to try some botanicals, um, you can use my coupon code MADDIE13, M-A-D-D-I-13, um, all capitals, and uh, that will give you a little discount. So next on my list of concoctions is Tianchi powder. It's um, like a Chinese herb. Uh, it's a cool ginseng, I think is what it's called, um, and it's supposed to help with um, kind of opening the lungs and that kind of thing. Um, I was just told it helps give them more runs. So Little Miss Grinchy Pants is a rock star, and this just kind of gives her a little oomph, <laughs> you know what I mean? So I just mix a teaspoon in um, some water, shake it up, and syringe it into her mouth uh, about two hours before I run. And apparently I've lost my big syringe, so usually I can mix it in that. I'm just going to mix teaspoon-ish with some hot water and then suck it up with syringe. Ew. It smells like herbs for sure. Okay, so now I use my nebulizer. I have a flexi neb, which is the cordless one. And before I run, bit of saline with some eucalyptus essential oil in it and give that to Grinchy. <laughs> now, there you go. She doesn't love it. Oh, you're fine. But we get it done. Well, I'm number 43. There's 125 entered. Um, I'm just going to hang out the trailer for a while. I don't really give Grinchy a whole lot of warm up, so... Um, I don't even have her saddled. I'll probably saddle her kind of around when it starts. They usually run about 40 to 50-ish an hour. So I figure I've got lots of time. So yeah, I'm just gonna hang out for a little bit. Yeah. I'm a little out of breath because I just finished my run. Grinchy was awesome. Um, I didn't take my camera over there with me because I don't really like to carry anything. Um, but when I warm her up, I just kind of trot a couple circles, lope a couple circles till her muscles are warm. And then I actually get off and walk her on foot because I find she gets a little bit excited. And then I don't actually get back on her until like one or two riders before my run. And then I get on, put my elastics on, we can go right in the gate. Um, I think she just kind of gets antsy if I sit on her back for too long. So. And that's what works for us. 
Yeah, and you're such a good girl, aren't you? You're the prettiest one.